When using reverb and delay in your mix, creating an effects return on an auxiliary instead of inserting a plugin directly onto an audio or instrument track has several advantages. Multiple reverb plugins across individual tracks can use more resources, while routing multiple tracks to an effects return can achieve the same desired effect efficiently and give better control of the signal being sent to the effect. Navigate to the sends of the channel you wish to add reverb to. Click on the first available send and scroll down to New Track. This will bring up the New Track window. Add a name for the track and click Enter. In the Mix and Edit window, a new track and new send have been added with the correct naming for the reverb return. Next, click the first available insert slot on the auxiliary track and select a reverb plugin. To send signal to the reverb return, click the send on one of the channels in your mix. A small floating window will appear and you can adjust the amount of reverb being sent to the reverb return.